Hi guys, welcome to Likeness Sculpting with Frank Zen. My name is Frank Zen, I'm from Taiwan. Right now I'm working as the lead character artist in Naughty Dog. Uh, if you're not familiar with my work, please go to our station and just search Frank Zen. Uh, you can see all of my work here, or you can simply go to um, just Facebook page and search Frank Zen's art right here. Um, I will basically put all my newest update, on my personal work, my per professional work uh, over on this two site. All right. So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how do I do likeness sculpting. Um, the result will be something like this. Um, this is just a ZBrush BPR render uh, without any touch in Photoshop. So let's just go to ZBrush and talk this really quick. So right now we are in ZBrush and I didn't do anything. This is just a BPR render. Um, so in this tutorial first I'm going to show you guys how do I get the references. How do I find photo reference of the actor that you're choosing and put the reference together as a reference sheet. After that, uh, we're going to start with a really basic um, head. So let me move around and show you guys how do I start with this. So that's the basic head that we're gonna, going to start with. And then um, after this, we're going to put the basic anatomy shape on the top of it break up the symmetry and after this part we're going over in details about how to sculpt secondary shape. Uh, secondary shape basically is um, all the small anomaly forms that you can see from the photo of the actor, uh, from the references of the actor. And then uh, we're going to post it after that, we're going to do all the skin details on the top. Um, in this sculpting tutorial, I'm also going to go over how to sculpt eyes correctly, nose, mouth, and ears, which is a lot of people um, don't really pay attention to. And then I'm going over how do I do eyelashes eyebrows um, using just geo placement um, and stubble hair in detail using fiber mesh. So after this 16 hours tutorial you should have a really solid understanding of the process that I use to create um, realism character uh, doing likeness sculpting. Um, and also you have to understanding how to do proper skin pour, uh, skin detail um, on the character and using fiber mesh to create uh, the hairstyle that you want. So thank you guys very much for watching this. Uh, we have a lot to cover. So let's just get started.